Hello everyone, hope you're doing fine. Today in this tutorial, I will show you how you can make table clothes. So let's start. First of all, for the clothes, I will use, uh, I will go to 3D object and I will select plane. And let's zoom on the plane. Okay, so let's use free. Okay, here is the plane. Let's change the name for the plane, mm, the cloth, and uh, let's give it some material. I have already downloaded the texture and I have included the uh, link for downloading this texture uh, in the description. So let's create, let's attach this uh, texture to our clothes just drag and drop it here and it will create the material and if you like you can also change the tiling here for example you can make it two two but i would prefer one one okay uh, and uh, the next thing that we have to do is to uh, create uh, i mean add the clothes uh, if you type CLO cloth um, and it will add this component to our like cloth and it will also add skin mesh render without changing anything we will just press play and you can see that it goes down without like showing that it is a cloth so uh, let's uh, do some chains and uh, go to cloth and uh, you can see this edit constraints and you can press this and go to paint and then you can see there are dots here on the screen so let's press top so we can view it from the top and let's zoom and uh, you know when you drop a table clothes on a table uh, there are some parts of the uh, like cloth that they stay straight and the rest of the clothes which are out of the table cloth they just like uh, hang from the corner from the edge of the table so we will just uh, try to um, like if you press these uh, parts that's uh, let's zoom in and yeah let's select these you can see these chains and they change into green dots we want these parts to stay straight that's why we're doing this okay uh, now again select free and uh, okay we have the same view okay now uh, we need uh, some other chains but uh, let's for the time being press, uh, press play and you can see that now it shows uh, the, the part that we selected not to like uh, not to like fold it stayed st like straight but the rest is like like they hanged from the table aids but this doesn't uh, really look good it's an awkward table close so uh, we can uh, like change the stiffness the stretching the stiffness uh, is uh, start from 0 to 1 if you like hover your mouse uh, here it will show the ranges from 0 to 1 and the damping is also from 0 to 1 uh, so currently it is disabled because it's 0 but we will change the uh, first the stiffness uh, it's one that's why it looks so like hard so we will like make it 1.2 of course i will prefer uh, sorry 0 0.2 but i prefer 0 0.5 let's uh, play again 
okay now it looks much better but of course uh, if we make it five okay oh it looks like the tablecloth is a little bit bigger than the table but now it looks really fine uh, dumping uh, let's uh, change the dumping to one but uh, it will slow down like you can see how it reacts when you put the cloth on the table so let's stop it and so we need something between 0 and 1 so we will put 0 0.5 and save and press play okay okay now our tablecloth doesn't look so good so i prefer to change the constraint again select tab and let's um, let's select one more like uh, like round so our tablecloth will look nicer Or you can like uh, make the like plane smaller. So let's try again. Three. Okay. Let's, okay. Let's press play. Yes, much better. I guess the tablecloth looks nicer now. But we can like make the stiffness to 3 or 4 okay yes i guess the tablecloth looks nicer now so uh, let's see what's this error okay it's greater than zero what's the problem okay yeah now we don't have error okay thanks for watching bye